Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we gonna check out top 3 best fishing lures. Starting at number 3, Striking Mini King. The Mini King spinnerbit is 1 8 ounce and has a single hammered Colorado blade. Color options include white, black, black blue, chartreuse white, red and sun perch. This is a small spinnerbit, but it is the one that I use most often for base. This bait can be fished slower and therefore a bit deeper than an inline spinner. In black, this works well for nighttime fishing. The hammered Colorado blade allows the bait to be retrieved slowly and still put off good vibrations. The small size makes it so that at night, if the bass strikes at the blade that is putting off vibrations it still has a good chance of getting hooked. Microing spinnerbits can be just as deadly on panfish as it is on bass, that's why Striking Mini King Spinnerbit has produced a smaller spinner style lure for bluegill and crappie. The Mini King Spinnerbit is similar to your favorite bass spinnerbit, but instead, is equipped with a single silver Tennessee diamond blade and uniquely patterned skirt strands which give the bait extra flair. If panfish aren't your thing try throwing the Mini King for smallmouth bass or even aggressive white bass. Check out the description for more information and latest price. Coming at number 2. Buyapaiki. The Buyapaiki weighs a half ounce. The bait features the Vibra FLX wireframe and silo tech skirt. A 12 steel leader is included with this bait for northern pike, muskie and pickerel fishing. This has double willow blades which is the most popular combo for two blade spinnerbits. Willow blades are typically retrieved faster than Colorado blades. This particular design works best reeling fast over top of vegetation. For this reason, this design is marketed as a pike lure. I actually stopped using spinnerbits in New Jersey because they would catch too many pickerel. Package dimensions 0.375 x 9.0 x 6.0 designed for targeting northern pike and muskies. The Buyapaiki spinnerbit offers all the durability that these fish require with an ultra tough Vibra FLX.45 wire that can stand up to a mouthful of shark teeth. On top of being ultra-tough, Pikey spinnerbits feature an 84-strand silo tech skirt which serves up a tremendous amount of undulating action as it moves through the water column. The Vibra FLX wire and silo tech skirt combine with the Pikey's jeweler's grade plated double willow blades to create loads of strike-provoking vibration and clattering commotion. Each Pikey comes with a 12-steel leader, so the Pikey is ready to fight right from the package. Weight, a half ounces. Check out the description for more information and latest price. And number 1 of this list, Berkeley Powerbait. The Powerbait Power Minnow is a 1 8 ounce jig with a 3 inch scented bait attached. Black Shad and Fire Tiger are the two color options. These baits come with two jig heads and eight shad bodies. Berkeley Power Minnow is similar to gold baits which are scented. Not many people use Live Minnow for bait and these are a great alternative. When baits are feeding on shad this bait is a great option. The 2-inch version works well for crappie and trout, while the 3-inch version works well for bass and walleye. Made using the highest quality materials engineered to help anglers catch more fish, the most trusted name in all fishing gear, preferred, proven and popular shape great for jig trailers, spinner rigs, drop shots and other bottom bouncing rigs. Stick worms normally aren't the most exciting bass fishing baits to review, if I'm being honest. This particular one, however, is a bit different than many of the others on the market. I've been pretty well set on just a few brands of stick worms for my fishing, but the Berkeley Powerbit the general has certainly made its way into the fold. It has also further solidified my belief that not all stick baits are created equal. You'll see dozens of different variations out there, but every now and again you'll run into something special. I believe I've done that with this worm. I started seeing posts about this worm on social media, and my buddies were giving it all kinds of hype, so I got a few packs and put them to the test for the past month or so. I'll quickly run through the things I've liked most about it so far. I have included this product links in the description. You can check out this link for more information and latest price. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel, leave a like and share with your friends.